What up, S fam? It's your boy Third Lynch back again with another motherfucking video. S fam, stand up, stay focused, motivated, get motivated. I'm in the game one time. Look, y'all, busting right out the bag. All right, gotta give a big, big shout out to Sarah Llewellyn for sending me that hashtag S fam react and the link in the comment section. And today we got angry cops. Army general doesn't know his own rifle on CNN. Y'all, this is probably gonna be the most embarrassing thing ever. Okay. There is no way, well, there might be some ways, but I wouldn't see how an army general would not know his own rifle on CNN, on TV. By the way, if you're first time to the page, comment, like, subscribe, hit that bell notification, stay updated every time we upload a brand new freaking video. So look, y'all, this dude should have already had some kind of notification or something. You're gonna be on TV, you're gonna be doing this, Whatever he should be shooting or whatever he's going to be freaking using to engage a target, he should probably look up on. He's a general, so I don't know. He'll probably have some time to do it. But anyway, we're going to go ahead and get into it right now, y'all. I want to thank Sarah Llewellyn for hitting me up with this freaking link to this video. We're about to get into it. Let's go! This is the M4 military rifle. Right. Rifle qual! This is the AR-15. Right. You can tell Angry Cops is already, already getting motivated. As soon as he heard the weapon... <laughs> Rifle! <laughs> Alright, y'all, let's go in. This is what an AR-15 sounds like. Ooh, I really hope he says pew, pew, pew. And this is what it looks like when an idiot with no training tries to shoot Why a rifle. Why is he not... Look at this dude's stance! He this looks like my 12-year-old sister holding a rifle for the like. first time! Is it gonna go... Why is he leaning back like this, man? Does he not know how to shoot? Look, that's... <laughs> doesn't know what he's doing already, man. This don't make no sense, man. This is my thing, bro. Army general. With him being an officer, he may not have any freaking experience. He might not have a lot of experience with these freaking rifles. You know what I'm saying? But my thing is, he is a general. He can call shots. He should be able to take some time off or something. Go to the range and freaking do And I know that he knew he was going to do this freaking interview. I know he knew. It wasn't at the last minute. And then, oh, here, take this rifle and just shoot it. You know what I'm saying? To make it look cool for the freaking nah. That's not what happened, bro. Couldn't have. Go off. Uh... Or some gun money that doesn't know dick about how to hold a weapon. All he needs is some fake knockers and a two-piece. Look at the way this guy's lean back. Look how about proper cheek to stock, buddy? If he was in my basic training class, I would have ripped the rifle right out of his grubby little hands. Probably would have freaking drop kicked him or something, man. If he would have been standing up trying to, well, he probably wouldn't have been up. But it's, I, it's just blows my mind right now, y'all. This blows my freaking mind, bro. Who knows? Let's go, man. Is this dude even aiming? Who taught this guy how to shoot? That buttstock is bouncing around his shoulder more than a freaking booty on BBW <laughs> night at Sharky's Gentleman's Club. A fine establishment in Fayetteville, North Carolina. How does he know he knows? He's like, he knows where the establishment is. And he knows what kind of stuff. <laughs> Let's go, man. It's a rifle, dude. Act like it's your lover's dangle and grip that thing <laughs> and maintain control of it while it's going off. Sir, the ah, US get Army your finger off the trigger! Look, look at him. A lot of people it. will buy this just because it's cool and they want to appear like soldiers. That's true. Some people do this on social media also. I would agree. <laughs> Non-veteran military accounts. <laughs> the we answered the question on who taught that reporter how to shoot. Mm, the hip power trigger the reset. Why is that the way that I imagine all generals shooting a rifle? No wonder they have such huge security details. I I don't get. I gotta take this back because I just don't understand how he's just letting the weapon go all over the place, man. Question on who taught that reporter how to shoot? Mm, is the hip power trigger reset. Why is that the way that I imagine all generals shooting a rifle? No wonder they have such huge security details. Now those are single <laughs> shots. If I wanted to fire this on full semi-automatic, full. full hold, hold on, hold on. Wait. I know. I know already. Full semi automatic, bro. Really? No. I know he's getting ready to say something about this. Let's go, battle. Let's go, man. Semi automatic, 
full semi-automatic. What did he just say? Who gave this guy stars? Where is this guy, Sergeant Major? Somebody get the smage! Smage? All I do is keep firing. Now, I won't probably hit the target. Oh, you won't hit shit. But don't blame that on the weapon. Exactly. It's a Operator weapon designed error. to inflict. Your grouping is horrible. <laughs> the signs of the wall say your target shouldn't be more than 25 to 50 yards away. How is your grouping not within that man-sized target? It looked like that dude had a shotgun and was just shooting away with it, bro. That don't make no freaking sense, bro. A general. He can't be used to shooting a freaking rifle, bro. He can't be. Let's keep it moving, man. How are you passing rifle qual? Were you jamming pen holes into it just to get a go? I yeah, think that one's yeah. close enough. Good chunk. I think I hit that one too. Good thing. Look at this quarter <laughs> space. Ugh. Looks like his butthole is about to turn coal into diamonds. I've seen soldiers who have been hit by this weapon and enemies who have been hit by this weapon where it will literally tear out the inside of the body. Yeah, what do you think comes out of that thing? Kisses? It's a weapon designed to inflict maximum damage. Compared to what? You ever see a 45? How about a shotgun slug? Looks like it took a freaking bowling ball and shot through somebody's sternum. I I'm just, I don't have much to say, man. I don't have much to say, bro. Let's go, man. A nine minute will make your head explode like a watermelon. I saw one soldier who was hit in a fratricide incident. Probably shot himself instead of going on patrol as one of your security details. <laughs> in the shoulder, and the round came out his ass. Yeah, that's what the bullets meant to they do. The around. five five six round was made to penetrate, ricochet around, and then take you out of the fight. No more deadly than any other round. This weapon is definitely not for every gun owner. This is why yeah, generals yeah. aren't allowed to walk around without a sergeant major present. I'll see you on the range for retraining. All right, y'all. So that was just freaking crazy, man. I just can't believe a general, a general. All right, y'all. We're going to keep it moving from right there. I got to give a big, big shout out also to Horde Seller requesting for me to react to angry cops responding to the Navy, to the to protester in a Navy uniform. Come on now, man. Especially at a time right now. As a time right now, I know we've been briefed that we don't go freaking protesting while in uniform, bro. So for this guy to be in the Navy and in uniform and protesting, first of all, he's going against freaking regulation. I don't know, maybe just Army regulation. Maybe the Navy, I don't think the Navy will be able to. Let's just see what's going on on this one right here too, y'all. Let's go. You a coward. You a coward. I bet that cop is like, bro, what are you thinking about? You're in the freaking military. You're showing that you're in the military and you're in my face right now. Let's go, man. You could be serving a way greater purpose than you know it. I've seen Somali pirates look at me like they want to fucking kill me. Now it really gets my goat. Now, I will say this much, though. For him to be in his uniform, his beard, I'm pretty sure his beard is not in accordance with freaking regulation. I don't think the Navy's allowed to wear it unless he got a shaving profile, but even that, his beard is too long, bro. Let me rewind it so I can show y'all a little bit. Look, you can see his beard, look. You know it, you see his beard. I've seen Somali pirates look at me like they wanna fucking kill me. Now what really gets my goat about this whole video is that it's a Navy dude. It makes me wanna do ah, What up, squid? You know what I love? When morons like you wear your uniform out to protest. It, it just means you, you want attention. So you don't let me do give it. You some of that attention. How much you serve something greater? He is serving something stupid. He's gonna spend 20 years trying to collect a pension, serving a community that he loves and lives in. Nice beard. You got lying. That's what up, I said. Get that That's what I off said, man. Out of gosh dang duds. You stupid piece of trash. Probably got dis. He is mad at this Navy guy, bro. He's mad at him. He's honorably discharged from the freaking Navy. And another thing, he's right about that. Most of the time, you see civilian cops. I've always seen cops in their community. They're serving in a community that they grew up in, trying to keep that community safe. That's what I've always seen. So I'm pretty sure he knows what he's talking about. Let's keep it moving, y'all. I can tell him who he is. You a coward. Did you just call this guy a coward? You pathetic prepubescent puddle of piss. Pre you in Somali pirates. Piss. Look at you. Now, I've seen Somali pirates look at me like they want to fucking kill me. Look at you. I'm an engineer, and even I know that is some pogue shit that just came out of your mouth. This guy is literally trapped among hundreds, if not 
thousands of people who hate each other, and you have the balls to call him a coward? A coward the best bro. story you have is how three dudes in a beat up fishing boat with a couple AKs <laughs> drove up past your naval ship and you looked at each other? Stupid semen. What were you gonna do? Grab a rifle? Oh, wait, I forgot. You had to go to the nearest Marine to protect you. There didn't you go. You? Look, look, didn't look. You? You're the type of guy that would probably claim that as PTSD. I bet the only time your boots touch the dirt is when you stopped off in Djibouti to get some <laughs> gosh dang green bean. Speaking of Djibouti, I'm about to get all up in yours, son. You're in the Horn of Africa. It's not even a combat zone. Get a ship are you on? The USS can't find a pair? The USS gets scared a lot? The USS change my drawers? The USS scaldy cat? The USS peed my pants? But you know what really gets my goat? The fact that you've got the balls to go up to somebody two inches from their face, scream obscenities, call them a coward, and make them feel like nothing. Cause he see, this is that part when he see how he calmed down like that. And I, I gotta tell y'all, I checked the comment section of this video first so I can see. And P hey, man, this is the part right here, bro. This is the part. Even I know, man, when you eat, like when I'm talking to trainees, it's one thing to be like when I'm yelling at them, but then when I get that calm, like that's when you know to be pissed. Anyway, let's keep it going, y'all. He has to practice restraint, something you obviously don't have. You're a piece of trash. He's pissed, bro. No music at the end of the video, no nothing, man. That's how you end it, bro. Anyway, y'all, I'm gonna go ahead and get off of here. I had to hit y'all with that.